hello everyone and welcome back to this channel welcome back if you're old welcome if you're new today the lord has laid it in my heart for us to do this prayer concerning marriages so we are going to be praying about marriages today we're going to be praying and asking the lord to break every power of delay holding our marriages and for those of us who haven't you know had any relationship yet and we are still trusting and believing god for the right person we're going to be praying and asking him to connect us to those people our destiny help us in the name of jesus the bible says in genesis chapter 2 verse 18 it says the lord god said it is not good for man to be alone i will make a helper suitable for him hallelujah the lord promises to make a helper for man and that was what he did he said it is not good for man to be alone it is not good for you to be alone it is not good for a man or a woman to be alone hallelujah and the Lord knew this and that was why he formed marriage and also in Genesis chapter 2 verse 24 the Lord says that is why a man leaves his father and mother and is united to his wife and they become one flesh hallelujah and so the marriage was instituted by God from the beginning and that is why we are praying right now because we know that it is the will of God for us to be married to be united to our kingdom spouse hallelujah so we are getting into this prayers right now and if you're believing god for a kingdom spouse can you just join me you know join your spirit to mind let's connect in the spirit and just pray about this believing and trusting god that it is going to come to pass and that every delay will be broken we are praying father in the name of jesus lord we worship you we adore you we give you all the glory we thank you for your love and your faithfulness we thank you for your promises oh god in accordance to your word in genesis chapter 2 you said oh lord that it is not good for a man to be alone and that was why you created for a man a helpmate a helper hallelujah and so lord we are here gathered oh god in one spirit in one accord praying oh king of glory that wherever our kingdom spouses are oh king of glory i pray for my sister i pray for my brother wherever the husband is wherever the wife is this moment as i pray let them locate them in the name of jesus your husband is locating you this moment in the mighty name of jesus your wife is locating you and i pray O king of glory and stand against every spirit of delay everything that has delayed your marriage from manifesting in accordance to god's purpose i stand this moment to say it is broken in the mighty name of jesus your marriage is released to you quickly in the name of jesus you will not suffer delay you will not suffer late marriage in the mighty name of jesus your word says oh lord that you will satisfy us early father i pray that even in marriage you are going to satisfy your people early in the name of jesus i pray and call for your kingdom spouse wherever he is this moment and i ask that let there be a divine connection a divine meeting in the name of jesus let the process of you meeting your kingdom spouse be speeded up in the mighty name of jesus and i pray that if you're already into a relationship this moment may the lord speed up every process for it to get into marriage if you need provision may the lord provide finances in the name of jesus i begin to pray and rebuke the hand of the enemy against every evil plan every barriers every roadblocks in your relationships every arguments every fightings every evil seed that he's trying to plan in order to prevent your marriage from manifesting by the power of god i declare and i decree it is broken in the name of jesus Jesus, I release you to your kingdom spouse in the name of Jesus. I speak by the authority given to me by my Father in heaven and under the same grace and anointing for marriage. I release your kingdom marriage to you quickly in the name of Jesus. Let it manifest in your life quickly in the name of Jesus. Let every curse that is holding you from manifesting your marriage be broken. Let every altar be broken, every foundations be broken broken in the name of Jesus all the generational curses let them be broken in the name of Jesus I send angels before you to begin to sweep your path for marriage so that you will walk on a smooth ground for your marriage to manifest in the name of Jesus every mountains before you every hills every barriers every stumbling blocks by the power in the name of Jesus I command they are broken in the name of Jesus and they are leveled in the mighty 
mighty name of Jesus, that assignment that the Lord has given to you in marriage, I decree it's coming to pass in the name of Jesus for your marriage is materializing in the name of Jesus. I begin to call to pass every word that the Lord has spoken over your life concerning your marriage. I decree that it is coming to pass in the name of Jesus. They are all being fulfilled in the mighty name of Jesus. Every strange assignment, every strange and evil assignment of the enemy against your marriage, against your relationship, against your kingdom assignment, against your kingdom spouse is broken in the name of Jesus. And I decree that the Lord will speed up things, will speed up the process for these to come to pass, for your marriage to come to pass in the name of Jesus. The Lord give you a testimony in the area of marriage in the name of Jesus. I speak a celebration that as you have been going and celebrating with others, people will also come and gather in your marriage ceremony in the name of Jesus. People will also come and gather to celebrate the goodness of the Lord in your life in the name of Jesus. People will gather to celebrate with you that as you have been laughing with others concerning their marriages, as you have been praising and thanking God for them, people will praise and thank God for you when they hear your testimony of marriage in the name of Jesus. Let the right doors begin to open. Every door that needs to be open, let it be open in the name of Jesus. I send angels to go before you and put in place everything that needs to be in place for your marriage to come to pass in the name of Jesus. It is the will of God for two to come together and be united for his kingdom purpose. It is the will of God for two to come together and be united in happiness in love, in matrimony and so I speak that into your life in the mighty name of Jesus. Every hope that was lost right now by the power of God, I declare it restored in the name of Jesus. Your hope is restored in the name of Jesus. Your faith in this area is restored in the name of Jesus. Every heart that has been sick because of this, I pray healing onto that heart right now in the name of Jesus. Every assignment of the enemy to make you sick concerning this to bring you down to bring depression sorrow frustration in this area of marriage by the power of God I declare it's broken and cancelled in the mighty name of Jesus in the mighty name of Jesus may the Lord restore to you the one that he sent to you that was lost may he restore to you your lost kingdom kingdom spouse your lost kingdom husband your lost kingdom wife may he restore them back to you in the name of Jesus. And if you are married and you are having problems in your relationship, may the Lord restore back that marriage in the mighty name of Jesus. I decree and declare that every difficulties and challenges are broken by the power of God in the mighty name of Jesus. I decree and declare that it is well with you. Good news is your portion. Favor is locating you. The favor you need to be located is resting upon on you right now in the name of Jesus. Favor is yours in the name of Jesus. Every wisdom that you need to make your marriage manifest is resting upon you right now in the name of Jesus. Every strange woman that is invading your relationship, I decree right now your relationship from God, I decree right now by the power of God, every Jezebelic spirit is removed in the name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus, I speak restoration restoration even in your relationships in the name of Jesus you are restored you are restored let the power of God rest upon you in the mighty name of Jesus may he guide you may he lead you and may he see you through may your steps be ordered by the Lord to the right places and the right persons in the mighty name of Jesus let your doors be open for this in the name of Jesus and may testimonies be a portion in the mighty name of Jesus may the Lord do for you what you cannot do for yourself and may you come back to glorify his holy name in Jesus mighty name. I pray and plead the blood of Jesus this moment in the name of Jesus because as I was praying um, you know at the beginning of this week the Lord just keep, kept on telling me um, just begin to plead the blood of Jesus the blood of Jesus so I'm going to encourage you also to just keep pleading the blood of Jesus upon your relationship upon the word of God that has been prophesied to you concerning 
concerning your marriage, you know, just use that blood. It is a powerful weapon. Hallelujah. It is a weapon that has been given to us by God and a weapon that will always be powerful. The Bible says that his blood will never lose its power. That is the greatest weapon against the enemy. Just keep using that blood. Just keep pleading it and keep prophesying your marriage for it is done. It is settled. It has come to pass already and we are going to glorify the name of the Lord for this. In the mighty name of Jesus, I crown this prayer all with the speed of God. Let this process all come to pass speedily in the name of Jesus. I crown it also with the blood of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. We give you all the glory. We give you all the praise, honor, and adoration. We ask, oh God, that you keep having your way and let your name keep being glorified in our lives in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen.